Hey guys, so a huge news coming in which is gonna make you wait for the Samsung Galaxy S22. So solid information coming in from Yogesh who got a decent track, Ice Universe and Digital Chat Station. They all say Samsung is joining hands with Japanese camera brand Olympus and this likely for in-body may stabilization. Galaxy Club also claims Samsung has been working to include in-body may stabilization in the S22. So all legit sources point towards Samsung bringing some hot changes in the Galaxy S22. The sensor shift stabilization is a mechanism which is something beyond EIS or even OIS. So in OIS aka optical image stabilization the lens move to give stable images and in IBIS which is in body image stabilization the mechanism stabilize your sensor to provide stable shake free video footage and sharp still images. And that's why Olympus is likely helping Samsung they've got amazing experience when it comes to making sensor shift cameras sounds great news coming in from korea say samsung will be skipping time of flight in the s22 series and this came as a shocker cause time of flight help in better portrait images and better night shots yeah i hope they include something which can give a tough competition to lidar cause it is on a different level right now Finally, Samsung X AMD is happening for sure and Ice Universe said they'll announce the official specifications of their GPU as early as June 2021. See, with the S21 series and Exynos 2100 CPU, Samsung made some huge changes in the performance and battery life. The only con is Mali GPU which is simply not as powerful as Adreno and Qualcomm flagship silicon right now. And to make things right, Samsung is joining hands with AMD and no shocker it may surpass Snapdragon flagship CPU and GPU next year. So yeah surely huge changes coming in in the performance and camera side. There is still no concrete details on if S22 will feature an in-screen selfie shooter. Yeah, however, chances are slim cause Samsung is likely reserving it for Galaxy Z Fold coming in a few months and Galaxy Note series next year. Xiaomi will also be showcasing the in-screen selfie shooter with the Mi Mix 4 this year. And if Xiaomi ends up launching a full-screen design with the Mi 12, it is surely gonna affect Samsung and S22. So yeah, let's wait and this all guys. Thanks so much for watching. I'll meet you guys in the next one. Peace out.